Hello, hello. How are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Libra. <laughs> I had to look and see who we we're doing. Um, hi. So here we are to do your August readings, August general readings. So we talk about a little bit of everything. You know, whatever comes up is going to be the message for you here today. Um, let's shuffle some cards here. That's what you're hearing. First, some friendly reminders. Friendly reminders that Tarot for guidance and entertainment. Wow. Purposes only, therefore not responsible for what you're doing after the reading. However, I'm here for you. If you're interested in a personal reading, click that description box down below, yo. All right. There's a lot that just came out, and I'm actually going to keep all of them. I don't know how I'm going to do this reading yet. Just bear with me. All right. Going into fall. That's right about now, right? Um, what's happening is you're staying in your power here because things weren't going your way. They just... I don't know what it was, but you did like roadblock after roadblock that was coming in. And you're like, okay, well, I don't know why this isn't working out. I don't know. Everything just feels so heavy right now. It Nothing's moving. Okay. So then we have some type of switch that happens. You do something that kind of changes everything. OK, because now we have a turn of events during this turn of events, especially between um, the middle of August and going towards the end of August. OK, um, we're going to have some movement happening where things are finally kind of aligning and getting into place. You're listening to your intuition more. If you hear stuff in the background, that's my dog playing with a toy. So I apologize. So in the meantime, you realize that there was some stuff that you couldn't push away anymore. Um, and you're kind of just trying to hold it all together. You know what I'm saying? You're just trying to do it all. You realize that there were some people that had to go because you're like, this change needs to happen. And guess what it is? Because there's progression from the eight to the nine here. Okay. So there's movement to change, to attain that change. And that change is here. And now it's coming to fruition. It just took a little bit longer than you wanted to rise up. So now you're finding the balance in between things and you're really happy about it because you're getting the recognition. Somebody's giving you the recognition, which is bringing us to the completion of one chapter and the start of another. Now, I do see for some of you, it involves uh, breaking up with a partner, okay? And it wasn't a happy breakup. This is, there was anger here because you guys were really close. Um, but then it's just, I don't know. We'll find out why that wasn't working out too. I don't see it being like a, just going our separate ways kind of thing. What's interesting is there's like unconditional love that's coming up. It's weird because we have the unconditional love and then we have like the, the finances and affection and all that good stuff, right? But I feel like it was a little more one-sided, whether it was you or them, I'm not sure. Because we have one person here, there's some betrayal here. And we have another person saying, like, you know what? I don't need this. I can find on my own. That kind of sounds like Libra. Libra's quick to cut people off, yeah. <laughs> so, it's okay because universe got your back here. It was a lot of work. Yeah, like, you're good. I don't know what they did. It's not coming up. I don't know what they did, but... Someone did something, and maybe this is you, I don't know. Someone did something, and it did not end well, regardless of one person having unconditional love for the other. I just feel like it was more one-sided. Okay? Um, so basically what's happening is your things are coming to fruition yet again. Okay? Um, and the reason why is because 
you have all the tools you need in order to go on the path. You've been working really hard and now you're on the right path. You've had to have lots of stamina and you've had to believe that there was a deeper meaning to all this so you can reach your achievements and your goals. It's just right now kind of feels all over the place. So leaving the month. You know, in the beginning, I thought your reading was going to be super chaotic because how it started. Um, but it's coming out pretty smooth. So maybe that is an indication for how it's going to go for you. You're going to think that it's going to be chaotic. And then it's like, oh, it's actually not so bad. So leaving the month. Why am I hearing, um, I was born by the river in a little tent, just like the river I've been running ever since. It's been a long, long time coming, and I know A change's gonna come, oh yes it will. <laughs> That's literally what those cars just said. Cabin to Holland. But I'm afraid to die. Letting go of control. Pushing through, letting go of control. The part of the song that's standing out to me is, um, I said, brother. Help me, please. This is the part where the brother is, he asks his brother for help. And, or he asks somebody for help. And, um, basically they wouldn't help him. So he had to go do it on his own. But. A change gonna come. Oh, yes, it will. <laughs> That's going to be your reading, guys. Until next time. Bye.